Welcome back, Cat Access Entrepreneurs. So in today's video, we are out here just doing playing crabby guys. Let me turn today. There we are. Uh, we just brought this one in. Tons of little dungeness guys. And uh, there's one little red. He's been stuck in this trap for the equivalent of three videos now. So that's interesting. We should, we should probably get out of here. If you guys know how to untangle crabs, comment down below. Um, this is just the intro to this video, and we will see more in a second. I'm gonna cast this back out there. Kinda of see what the line is. It's still, I'm gonna grab the hold out for a second. Probably close it though, because at this point it's just going to the way. And uh, check it back in. in a couple minutes. I'm gonna update. Let's see if we can find any crabs in the water. One thing that's just need to today is it has an extremely high slowly level. Thank you just new every time. So you'll find more of the red rock and the European green crab because of the high salinity level in the water, which means good things you want to eat. There's one more than this way and he's more to keep. But now we got that back out there. In this next video slowly, it's gonna be a fun one. You're perfectly at same set. Great time to be here. you're gonna get out from crabbing here on New Source Bay. So if you come here on a weekend, you're gonna see anywhere. I came here on a Sunday morning and counted 19 boats out on the water. It's quite, gets quite busy on the weekend, but if you come here on a, it's a, it's a thing of filming this, it's not probably not gonna be released for a few more days, but right now is a Monday. It's like 6.30 on a Monday. So if you come here at 6.30 on a Monday, I can't see this because the sun's there, but there's, no one here. No one else crabbing. Or at least no boats. So that's one thing I really want to share about the New Jersey Bay experience. Another thing is the you're gonna see the seagulls, and one of the things that New Jersey Bay has to offer that's kind of fun are those. Those are harbor seals. I've covered those in the New Jersey Bay uh, ultimate guide. Well, I'll actually it's just the ultimate guide to crabbing, which I can try and put in the upper right hand corner of the video right there. Which I will try to link in the upper right hand corner of the video right there-ish. Uh, so that's just another thing you're going to note. The crabs in here, you're going to find a lot of small red crabs, and the dangerous ones don't get very big, you're going to want to come in the months with an arm, and once again, all this is already covered in the ultimate crowding guide. I'm just trying to do stuff that's specific here to New Church Bay. And for New Church Bay, it gets down around 20 feet there, and the entire rest of the bay, it's only around 6 to 10. So it's actually, probably closer to 4 to 6. You're hearing those cars, they're going to find us on what is New Church Bay Drive. Very disappointed. You can go right over there. You can see where that American flag is. Can I see that American flag? That is the schooner uh, bar and grill. Quite overpriced food, but it does have food. So if you're very just, if you feel knocked down after a day of not catching crab when you're out here crabbing which does not seem likely, you can just head right over there and get some food. Our Bay is around 15 minutes away from downtown Tillamook, if that's if you're wondering. But if you forgot to grab your bait, around five minutes up that road, going on to Highway 131, you can get to go to Bayside Market in Delhi and they will also have chicken. Also around two or so minutes down that road, you can find an RV park, and inside that RV park, there's a little house, and I've heard that they sell chicken too. Not confirmed though. Yeah. 
Hearts Bay is also nice because it's a very quiet, peaceful bay. One thing that makes you think Hearts Bay unique is it's uh, and makes it so peaceful is the fact that it doesn't. It is illegal to fish for salmon, trout, or steelhead in this river. It does have a hatchery right down there, but for salmon, trout, and steelhead, it is illegal to fish here, which means a lot of the salmon anglers, which will be coming out and filling up the whole the whole bay, can't, are not actually coming here and instead going to Tillamook Bay which is, if you go north of down here, too. So that's something that makes this really good. Uh, New Church Bay is known for its crabbing and its clamming. Welcome back, Hand Actors Attributors. We are here, and back for the New Church Bay crabbing experience video. I have just brought in this giant trap. We're going to see what we actually caught here. So, that's a dungeness right here, so that's a female, so, a lot of little dungeness, we don't, these, can't keep him, so this guy will be going back, careful because I can pinch. Bay experience and what you're going to experience when you're out here. That way you can prep if you've got a trip coming up and uh, just give you a whole lot of better info. Uh, so other videos will probably be like right Other videos will be right there. That's probably going to be the next video you're going to watch. And thank you so much for watching Hand Axe Satchel signing off.